Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to tell you guys how to make Rainbow Six Siege less frustrating. Now, Siege is a very, I'm going to say intense game, especially if you're like me and Ragnar, where we play two to three hours of ranked sometimes straight. Normally, I'm the one that's like, I gotta go downstairs, get a cup of coffee, I gotta go downstairs and eat dinner, I gotta go downstairs and do the dishes. But every once in a while, we get in those games where we just play and play and play. And let me tell you, 99% of the time, you end the seat, you end and go to bed frustrated as hell. Okay? I'm just gonna say that. But recently, I've been finding I'm not getting frustrated at this game. And I'm gonna tell you guys exactly why. It's very simple. When I play Rainbow Six Siege, I focus on a couple things. Now, I still get frustrated. I'm not some god that can never be frustrated. My brain can never be penetrated by a simple video game. No, 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 no. You can ask, if you guys go on Ragnar's channel, just be like, when does Pacific get frustrated? I went six rounds on the haunted house without getting killed. That, it was, blah. So, to make it less frustrating, Okay. Now, first of all, don't always play ranked. Me and Rag, um, sometimes we play casual, and we have a rule in casual. You experiment and find new ways to play the game, right? Like the other day, Ragnar was like, you know what? I'm going to get good at the boss G with Vigilant Dokubi. So that's what he did. He spent the entire time getting good at the boss G. And he didn't get frustrated at all. Yeah, he died as many times as he would in a normal siege session, but he didn't get frustrated. Just trying new things. Me, I'm like, I want to get better at Clash. Or, I, I don't know what to do, I'm going to let the game decide. In casual. You know, I'm not going to throw a casual match if I'm just playing with Ragnar. If there's five of us, we can do whatever we want. But, Rag and I, we don't like to throw the matches most of the time. You know, casual, there's kind of no penalty for doing that. And it's just generally a toxic place. More toxic than ranked. So, try new things when you're playing Siege. Just spice up your strategy. Okay, I was really happy when I learned how to play Legion. Because at the end of it, I could play Legion and just know how to play Legion now. It's not frustrating if someone picks an Oppa that I like. I can just pick another one because I know how to play most more of them really well now another thing is you have to play siege with what i call the growth mindset which is i am not here to win i am here to play my best and learn it you know it's a really good sign that you have this mindset if as soon as you die you're like rooks in the corner mute is behind that window you die they have a finca. Like, if you are dying, and instead of being like, duh, 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 and like, punching the monitor or whatever, you're call-outs. And, you, you know, you're not raging at the video game, at the siege. You know, you're, you've achieved zen. You've achieved less frustration. Simply by going into siege and analyzing yourself, and trying to learn as much as you can, you will get less frustrated. You will be frustrated if you play and don't learn anything. You will not get frustrated for getting your butt kicked. And let me tell you, when I do this and I do it well, we can play Siege and like lose 4 0. We'll, we'll be 0 and there'll be 4. And I'll still have a fun time because I'm learning stuff. So that's how you make Siege less frustrating. That's just for me, is you gotta try new things. And you gotta just have this growth mindset. You gotta come in wanting to learn things. And eventually, you get really good. Right? Uh, I'm, ha I'm really happy with my, my personal results from this. Is Ragnar and I, well, it was for me. He did it for me, which was really, really nice of him. Is this season in Grim Sky, I got to Platinum. The last time I got to Platinum, was in Skull Rain. I want to say that was over, that was eight seasons ago. I got to Platinum in Skull Rain. I almost got to Diamond in that one. That was extremely frustrating and devastating. But, 
the way the game is. I would love to know what you guys think in the comments below. How do you cope with the frustration of Siege? Do you get frustrated at the game, or are you just some god who can't get frustrated? I would love to know in the comments below. Subscribe for more videos. I'm Steve the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I'll see you in the next episode of Stream Vlog, Steam Post, of whatever I decided to make.